everyone, it's Lauren from Tastemade here today with Chris and Bryce from the new Jurassic World movie. Thank you guys so much for being here. Oh, it's thrilled oh, to be here. Thank you for playing our game. Um, but before we get started, I would love to know just a little bit more about what happens in the new movie. Should I write it? You can, it might take a while. So it's called Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. It's been four years between Jurassic World and where we are now. The mm -hmm. park has been abandoned and there's a volcano that is on the verge of eruption. And everyone on the planet is arguing, you know, do we go in and, and rescue these animals or do we let nature take its course? Mm -hmm. And all of these dinosaurs are gonna be extinct again. Yeah. I can't wait. Yeah. I'm so super that's, excited. That's where it starts. And so Chris will share with you his interpretation. It's beautiful. Ah, oh that could be not the new bad, cover actually. art. Yeah, that's I know. really not that bad, Chris. Time, <laughs> what an artist. <laughs> so I'm sure you guys have learned a thing or two about dinosaurs along the way while oh, yeah. filming. And today, I've learned a thing about dinosaurs, thing. but not two. Maybe not two. <laughs> okay, well that's fine. Yeah. So today we're gonna find out which one of you is the real dino expert. Okay. We're gonna play a trivia game. I'm gonna ask you guys seven questions. You'll write your answers down on your whiteboards, and then for every question you get wrong, you get to pick one of these mystery ingredients, and you'll have to eat it. Oh. So, um, so if you lose, you get to eat. Exactly, but okay. some of them are good, and some of them are maybe not the best. Oh. Okay. So you don't know what you're okay. gonna get. Listen, I'm a little bit hungry, and okay. this is gonna be a fun game. All right, so for your first question, the word dinosaur is of Greek origin, meaning terrible lizard. False. True, it is in fact true. Well, like it sounded so true. I was I like, know, it's maybe you're you. tricking me. I could have, I could have. Don't stall. So eat. Which, where, where, where? Whatever one you want. Oh, oh, that's a good one. Oh, you got chocolate? Chocolate toffee. False. <laughs> the next question. How many years ago did the dinosaurs become extinct? 1.5 billion, 285 million, or 65 million? Oh, gosh, I can't open this. Well, it's a bit of a trick question. I know the answer you're looking for, but Ooh. there's a likelihood there were animals that went extinct in each of those three periods, you know? I'm ready. Reveal. Both got that one right, but you seem to have some more knowledge than, than we might on these dinosaurs. It's all about saying <laughs> random stuff with confidence. That's true. Your next question is, which of the following dinosaurs had a giraffe-like neck? The Brachiosaurus or the Torvosaurus? Ready? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see it. The B1 and Brachiosaurus, both correct. Yay. We'll accept that. Yeah. Yay. We did it. We will accept it. Okay, for your next question. The meteor that many scientists believe killed the dinosaur struck in what country? I don't, I might, I'm gonna go with this. Okay, reveal. Well, Africa, I... South America, Brazil. So the correct answer is Mexico. Uh... Many scientists believe it struck in Mexico. Whoa, really? Yeah, yeah. There's like not I mean, a lot of. You guys can do, yeah. The same. You know. Oh, that. dang, that's good. What is that? Is that vegetables? Key sprouts, yeah. Have you heard of vegetables? I want, to, I want more vegetables. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one is a spelling one. So spelling does count. How do you spell the dinosaur? Uteraptor. Uteraptor. Yeah, uteraptor. Uteraptor? Origin? <laughs> Just kidding. I have, I'm taking a guess, but I'm, okay. I, here's my guess, is it was discovered in Utah. I had a similar guess. Wow, you guys both got that one right. Hey! That's really impressive. Okay, question number six. Yes. What was the wingspan of the smallest known pterosaurus? 10 inches, 10 meters, or 10 feet? Okay, let's see them. 10 feet, 10 feet, it's 10 inches. Really? Yeah, it's Ten, really tiny. I thought like Saurus. I was like, they're pretty big. I know. So you guys get to pick another one, yeah. You feeling this one? Uh, yeah, but. You, you okay. haven't let us down yet. Uh, bee pollen? Bee pollen. Guys, we're getting like, all of our superfoods in here. I know. Bee pollen? Where, okay. is it, where does it come out of a bee's what? Po the pollen. Okay, for the last question. Most dinosaurs were carnivores, herbivores, or omnivores? Most dinosaurs were, oh, uh, you know what? Carnivores, herbivores, omnivores. We got one. What'd you put on yours? I put omnivore. It was herbivores. Nice work. Oh, yes. Great. Great. Because I was kind of like, that's really sophisticated to be able to do, like that's like kind of what's a little bit special about us, right? Yeah. The good news is Go ahead. that was our final round. Dude! Gummy <laughs> world. Yes. You were for oh, it. Those look like they'd be a good bass lure. So the good news is you guys are both equal dino experts. Congratulations. Listen, that's a miracle. First. You have no idea. That is a first. 
Thank you guys so much for playing. And can you remind everyone when they can go see the movie? Go see Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom as it opens in the theater, June 22nd, baby. June 22nd. Woo!